My name's Emma Twig from New Zealand and I race in the women's single scale. Hi, my name is Kim Crow. I'm from Australia and I'm rowing in the single scale. My name is Mirka Knapkova. I'm from Czech Republic and I row on single scale. Uh, they're both very gutsy. Um, they both row beautifully. Um, both of them have been in the single scale a lot longer than I have um, and they've really made the boat class their own. I think they're, they're both great athletes, great people. We have a lot of fun together. Um, Kim's obviously a, a bit of a specimen and, and she, she's come out of the woodwork and, and has become like the leading contender in the single scale so she's the person with the bullseye on her back at the moment. Emma has a great turn of speed and that's something that you want to know when you're out there racing her. Um, Merka's, you know, she's been around for years and years and she's very consistent. She's always, you know, in the top few. Uh, so, yeah, Olympic champion and again, a very strong contender. We know each other because we rode together in Boston in eight. So it was exciting race because um, Alit single scar sit uh, in one boat and didn't compete against each other but together. Yes, you're out there, you race as hard as you can, um, but we are friends and um, it's really nice having that single sculling community. It takes a special person to be in the single scale, people think we're crazy, but at the same time it's very challenging to, to kind of know that you're, you're it and if you have a bad day then you're not going to be able to get down the track as, as fast as you'd like so it's, it's a matter of getting yourself to the start line in the best condition physically and mentally and and all the hard work that comes from being alone in the single will hopefully help when you line up on the start line um, against some of the best in the world. I did athletic before, so uh, I used to uh, compete just for myself. The responsibility is for myself. And I know that sometimes it's hard, but I like it. Obviously when you're out racing, um, you are there by yourself and that's a huge challenge and I think that's what excites me about the boat class. I think everyone has, has their weaknesses but it's a matter of trying to pinpoint those on the day and, and use that to your advantage. I think the best thing a rower can do is to play to their strengths when you get into a race and say I know the training that I've been doing and so I know what I'm capable of in different parts of the race. As exciting as it is to have had a good year last year um, Rio's a long way away, um, everyone's got a lot to improve um, and so it's important for me that I keep stepping up um, even more than everyone else keeps stepping up. My performance uh, improve every day so uh, I will be better and better in the season so the difference between us uh, will be smaller and smaller. I hope that, it, that we push each other and that it's you know, really close racing and that we, we can all gain something from each other. I think it's, it's looking to be a really good battle at every time we race throughout the European season.